Hello everyone, and I hope you enjoyed those little replays. So this is the Topologic Paleo deck. It pretty much just abuses the fact that Topologic monsters exist, and since Topologic Bomber Dragon can destroy every monster in the main monster zone, Topologic Zeroboros can banish everything, and Topologic Trisbana can banish every back row card, those are pretty much Board clearers. The only downside for those monsters is the fact that the monster has to be summoned to a link zone they point to, or to a zone a link monster points. And should that happen, that monster will also be affected by the topologic dragon's effects. But what if that monster was not affected? And that's where the Paleozoics come in. Every Paleozoic trap can special summon itself as a monster. It's a normal monster, aqua type, level 2 with 12 attack and zero defense. However, the thing that's very important is the fact that if summoned this way, the Paleozoic is unaffected by monster effects. Also, since those are all traps, which can be summoned when a trap is activated, those can be a somewhat of a quick play, meaning that a Topologic Bomber Dragon, Topologic Zero Boros, and Topologic Trisbana pretty much evolve into a quick play disruption, especially if Paleozoic Opabinia is on the field, since Opabinia's effect allows Paleozoic traps to be activated from the hand. In order to get this every rolling we of course are using the light swarm engine since we since we want our paleozoics in the grave and we're using the frog engine with do frog ronin totem and swap frog because well this exists this deck is very straightforward in what it does it's very interesting has very neat capabilities when it comes to disruption i think it's a very neat concept for a frog paleo deck so what did you guys think? Leave your thoughts in the comments below and I will see you next time. Jacob will signing out. Peace.